firms can also hedge their interest rates risk to matching their liabilities with the corresponding assets how firm can do this activity let's see an example we have the uh, we have a market based balance sheet of a bank who has assets of worth 1000 million dollars and liabilities worth 900 million dollars so the market value of equity of this bank is 100 million dollars now we see that uh, there is a zero duration on overnight money on the assets side and checking and saving accounts on the liabilities side of the bank both have zero duration uh, because the interest rate paid in, interest paid on these two types of instruments adjust immediately to changing interest rates in the economy now banks management is worrying on the interest rates because they are unknown about the movement of that uh, directions of the movement in the interest rates so they think that bank is uh, vulnerable to the uh, changing interest rates in the economy now they have got a consultant opinion on hedging the consultant hedge ahead uh, uh, this consultant has determined duration of this bank in terms of its assets and its liabilities and both these two items has equal have equal duration of 2.56 years so according to the uh, consultant's opinion the bank is immune to the interest rate risk because du the duration of bank's assets is equal to the duration of the bank's liabilities but bank's management is not satisfied with this particular computation and the opinion set by the consultant so they have sought an other consultants on this issue now the second consultant has some different opinion this consultant says that the duration of 2.5 uh, 5 6 years is incorrect because the bank's assets are more than its liabilities this means that as long as the bank assets are greater than the bank's liabilities so the price movement uh, price changes in the assets should also be higher than the price changes in the liabilities but for the interest rate risk immunity the duration of assets should be equal to the duration of liabilities so according to the opinion of this second consult, uh, consultant to be immunized to be immunized against the risk of interest rate movements some model should be there as a truth this means that the duration of assets in terms of its market value should be equal to the duration of liabilities with reference to the market value of the liabilities now he, she has an advice for the bank that don't equate the duration of liabilities with the duration of assets rather it is better to match the duration of liabilities to the duration of assets she has suggested two ways to achieve this target the first is to increase the duration of liabilities without uh, changing the duration of assets or the second is decrease the duration of assets without changing the duration of liabilities now how this can happen the first case is that the increase of duration of liabilities without changing the duration of assets according to this second consultant the bank should increase the duration of liabilities to 2.84 years in this way the uh, bank can be immunized if the duration of assets with reference to the duration of liabilities in terms of 2.56 into 1 billion uh, 1 uh, 1 million 1 billion dollars 
should be equal to the duration of liabilities with reference to the market value of the liabilities. Now the duration of liabilities is 2.84. If we multiply this duration with the market value of the liabilities, then the both of the sides of the balance sheet will be having equal amount of duration. The second suggestion of the consultant is to decrease the duration of assets without changing the duration of liabilities. And according to the opinion in this regard, the bank should try to decrease the duration of liabilities to 2. Point, uh, sorry, decre uh, the bank should decrease the duration of the assets to 2.23 years. In this way, the duration of the assets of the bank will be equal to the duration of the liabilities of the bank and both will be matching with each other. But there is a caution that if there is any mismatch between the duration of assets and duration of liabilities, then any quicker change in the market interest rate will have slightly reduction in the amount of liabilities of the bank but it may completely wipe out the equity of the bank in terms of its market value. So it may have directly a negative bearing on the market value of the bank's equity.